Welcome to a lesson with Dr. Powell. Let's take a look at it, at um, how we can write the formula for a polynomial given some information. Perhaps we know that f of x has degree five. Maybe it has a root at x equals um, negative a half. Um, and maybe that has multiplicity um, let's suppose it has multiplicity three. Um, and suppose that we have another one at x equals uh, three of multiplicity um, of multiplicity two. And we also know that f of zero is equal to is equal to two. So based off that information, let's see what we can come up with. Now, you see this root right here with a negative one over two. Think of this two as being a factor of the leading and this one as being a factor of the constant. So naturally we think factor of the leading would come from here, factor of constant would come from here. Naturally we can think two X and then a one here. And then we just need to correct the sign so that this would be a solution. You can imagine plugging a negative a half here times two, that would be a negative one. So it looks like we need a plus one here to make it work. So two X plus one is a factor. And you see the multiplicity three here. That means that the exponent we raise this factor to is three. Then right here, this next part, X equals three, we think of a factor that when we plug in three, we'd get zero. Well, X minus three and the multiplicity of two, there would be a two and we're almost done. We need to rectify this situation right here. When we plug in zero right now to what we have, it's kind of like this part and this part going away and just having left with one cubed times negative three squared, which would be like nine times one, which would be nine. Hmm. Well, we need to multiply by something to correct that. So we get uh, two in this case. All right. So this is what f of x is. It's some constant, like a vertical stretch or something, multiplied by this. We need, to, we need to choose a strategically so that when it multiplies to nine, we're going to get two. Because what we want is we want f of zero is going to be equal to a times, and then with that being zero, it's just one cubed. And with that being zero, it's just negative three squared. So we end up getting nine A, and we want F of zero to be two. Hence, we can figure out what A is. Divide both sides by nine, and we see two ninths. So that means in the end, the polynomial that we desire is this one. That meets all the criterion. It even has degree five because these guys add up to five and we're good to go. Thanks for watching.